Valentino Rossi may have retired from the sport, but the MotoGP legend will still have a presence in the paddock in 2022 as he brings his VR46 squad up from Moto2 into the Premier class with Ducati machinery. His half-brother Luca Marini is one of five riders who will receive the 2022 spec Ducati bike for the upcoming season, while Moto2 graduate Marco Bersecchi will race the 2021 bike. Here's what the riders had to say after two days of riding around her red. The new bike is uh, fantastic. The 2021 bike uh, gives you a lot of feedback and feeling, good feeling. So it's, uh, it's a very good bike in the handling and uh, it's nice to, to ride. And also it's um, a pleasure to to have the, this great team and we have a very great group uh, full of great people and uh, the atmosphere in the garage is uh, fantastic so there, uh, there is a lot of uh, energy and charge for making great things uh, next year so we started very well this uh, 2022 season. Exactly, I would like to ask you about that because I saw David Munio on, the, on your side of the garage. How is working with him? Yeah, yeah. I, we have some new, new people in, in the garage about uh, with my crew, and uh, sincerely, everybody um, that are with me, I wanted them so much. I push a lot to have them, to have these people, to have this group because uh, I trust a lot in these people and in my opinion we, we can do great things and uh, having David is great, uh, we have a re really good relationship from Moto2 times. It was a nice two days on the bike, of course the, the learning process is uh, very, very long but I took uh, this, uh, these two days with a lot of calm just to adapt uh, my, my riding a little bit to the bike, adapt to the position and uh, can't complain about today. Uh, I had a good feeling overall every time uh, that I go out on track. I was not impressive fast but the important is that I take some confidence with the bike. And also I start to use the rear advice on the straight, uh, so practice start, uh, start to be in the mood for the, for the races also, uh, so it was nice. And just coming from Moto2 uh, up to the top class, what, like in your riding style, what are the main things that already you figured out that you're going to have to adjust to go faster? There are a lot, a lot of things to change, but uh, overall the riding style is very similar to the Moto2, just uh, the, braking, uh, the braking style is a bit different. Uh, you can use a lot more the rear brake with the Ducati uh, and also the use of the front brake has to be different, but overall uh, not so big difference compared to the Moto2 riding, just the bike is a lot more fast, uh, so all the reference points of the track uh, are changing. Uh, managing the tire is uh, more difficult, uh, the fuel tank is uh, more difficult also to understand. So there are many things to learn. Stay tuned for more testing updates as we build up to the 2022 MotoGP season, which you can watch live right here on Spo TV.